Good evening, everyone. I'm here with my wonderful wife, Laura. Hello. I'm Nathan, and we're here to play and review the Elf game. We sure are. Um, if you're unfamiliar with Elf, it was oh. a TV show. In the 80s, about an alien puppet that liked to eat cats and get up to mischief. I don't know. I didn't really watch it much because I'm not quite the right age, but, you know. Same here. Uh, but this is Elf. Anyway, uh, if you're not familiar with it, and yeah, it was a really popular show. I think a lot of people remember, remember it, it fondly. Yeah, yeah so. Um, I can also tell you, spoiler, this game sort of is not good. Oh, don't spoil it oh, right at the start. I know, I know. <laughs> so the idea of this game is that uh, obviously Elf is an alien, uh, so he can't be seen by Mrs. O. I'm not going to pronounce her name fully. I didn't watch it and I o don't know how to say it. It's this one here. So Mrs. O, she will be referred to for the whole video. And while he's avoiding Mrs. O, he has to try and eat Lucky the cat. Eat the cat? Eat the cat. Doesn't he have to take the cat for a lunch or something? Yep. Oh. Yep. Oh. Mm. Yeah, so he's going to go and meet up with the cat uh, Yeah. while avoiding Mrs. O because, of course, uh, you don't want your alien to be seen by people who are going to report you for having an alien. Alrighty then, so shall we try and eat ye old cat? Oh, I didn't realise we were eating the cat. Mm, <laughs> that's his favourite food, didn't you know? It, well, no, I've, I don't think I've ever <clears throat> seen an episode. I've seen maybe like the occasional clip on, on it, you know, on something else. But um, So here's the instructions. It's actually like a, a cardboard insert. I actually scanned this and it'll be up oh, down below the link to the manual in case you buy a copy and it doesn't have it in there. Yeah, mm. I mean, usually you have the insides of the box but occasionally you never know it can happen so there's the uh, the board um so presumably this is the looks like the home of the people elf lives with again i haven't seen it so i don't really know much about the show in I, general i do like it's all hand drawn it reminds me of the home alone board gang yeah it does a little bit the design uh so there are family members on the board as well as the lucky space so this is where you want to land to finish the game after doing a full circuit of the board finish the game finish the cat yeah sure uh you have to land by exact count to win the game uh, but you can after you go past it then go backwards and until forward. that point you can only go <clears throat> clockwise in you know a lot of regular board games too. that's pretty much it uh, it's not actually. So we also have Mrs. O, who will start from here. She's he hello. To, <laughs> she's going to move around the board as well and uh, basically try and see us. The other player wants to make Mrs. O see their opponent so that uh, they can escape and, and get to Lucky. Yeah, so if they're, if your play is seen by Mrs. O, you go back to the last character space, which is like a safe space. Yeah, you're, you're hiding behind one of the family members, essentially. But you obviously don't want to go backwards because then you're not close enough to Lucky. Um, so this is a very, in terms of like life, Games. This is pretty bare bones. You've got four cardboard markers in different colours of elf. Mm -hmm. uh, uh, obviously, one of Mrs. O. And I don't believe that uh, big <laughs> black dice is the original, but you've got two dice. One yes. is to move your character, and the other one is to move Mrs. O. Yes. So, uh, well, how about we, we start? Do you want to roll and go first? Which, which colour are you going to be? We should probably pick some pieces Six. first. Um, I'll be red. Okay. And Laura, we blue. Yes, thank you. So we all start on the start space. We can land on the same space, I might add. Uh, yeah, so we roll both die, but we don't uh, move both for no. the same piece. So that, I, didn't, that, that took a long time to come out of my mouth. I believe when you roll dice, you can use either or dice for your character. And yes. then the other dice is used for the character you didn't for move. For Mrs. O, Correct. Yes. So you can choose which you use for each. So you have to work out which is more to your advantage. Uh, so Nathan, take it away. You've got two sixes, so both you and Mrs. O are moving. Well, that was my roll to see who goes first. Oh, I said you could go first. Oh. And then you rolled. No, 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 no. I just wanted to roll who goes oh, first. Oh, I see how it is. <laughs> so four and three. Okay. So I'll try and get away from Mrs. O. And go one, two, three, four. And Mrs. O will go... One, two, three. Now, Mrs. O can go backwards as well. Uh, so maybe like if, if Mrs. O was getting close to Nathan, Nathan would want to move her in the opposite direction to kind of escape a bit quicker. Or maybe not. You never know. I like Mrs. O. All right. Let me see. So I'm going to go five. One, two, three, four, five. It's hard because we're both kind of grouped together. <laughs> Do I want to move closer? I'm going to move back just to try and, and I believe she myself. has to land on the exact space that you're on. Yes. So if you go, if she goes past an elf, it doesn't count. No, which is, you know, I mean, good in the game, uh, wouldn't work in real life. No. One, <laughs> but then elf wouldn't be here two, in real life, would he? Three, four. Um, but you know what so, that does to me? I have to move ahead one now. <laughs> when you're on her anyway, so yeah. now we both get back to the start. 
Your well, turn. that didn't work out, did it? Beautiful. <laughs> uh, so because there's no family member that we've passed we yet. We just go back to the elf space. Yes, which is the start space. Six and two. Okay. Hmm. <laughs> this is tough. Uh, we'll go one, two, three, four, five, six, and then one, two. Oh, no. Two. Not my elf. He's now in board game form. Yeah. Okay. Uh, hmm. <laughs> one, one and one. One. Yeah, it's a kind of unfortunate game to roll doubles in. You don't really it's get a lot of choices a... then. <laughs> okay. So one, two, three, four, five. And ba -ba She's doing her job really well, I have to say. Yeah, Mrs. O with her rolling pin there. Right. Just in case you didn't see her before, she has a, a rolling pin in hand. No, it's the used, doesn't want to show it's you. used for beating. Where was she there? Yep. yep. One, two, three, four. One, two. There we go. Now we're starting to get somewhere. That doesn't look good five for me. Five, six. One, two, three, four, five, six for me so I can try and get away. One, two, three, four, five. Oh no, she's seen Elf again. Oh <laughs> no. One, two, three, one. She's coming after you, Laura. Is that right? I'm gonna try and get away. One, two, three, and obviously I'm gonna move Mrs. O backwards. So at this stage, uh, Nathan and I can't move our own pieces backwards. No. Just to clarify one, two, if I didn't three, mention. Four, five. I'm gonna see if I can meet around the other end. Oh, okay. I know, strategy. One, two, and then where, where is she on the start? She's on elf. Yeah, you kind of put her in halfway between her. Oh she? no! Uh oh, Nathan has lost one of the dice. Uh, I'm gonna dance on. while I. What do they get? What do they get? I don't know. I'm gonna roll again. <laughs> I think that's four. wise. One, two, three, four. One, two. I think it's. Mm. I mean, it's not a great game as it is, but I think it'd be more interesting with four players. Oh, definitely, because you have more people to try and catch. One, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four. Mm. Oh. See my, my expert strategy oh, here? Oh, I see it. I don't really have a lot of choices at the moment. <laughs> oh, Nathan's really trying to come find me with Mrs. O. She's going she's gonna to get with that rolling pin. Two, oh, I'm with Lynn here. Let us know if you watched One, the two, show, three, four, by five. the way. Yeah, I mean, I'm, I was very late 80s born. I think this was like mid 80s. I don't know. The, the game was 1987. Yeah, so. so. We, were, we were too young <laughs> when it was out. Uh, one, two, three, four, three. But let us know maybe whether you watched it when it was originally on or maybe it's something like you've seen elsewhere later. Maybe you, know, you weren't the age for it It's not really either. shown on TV here. No, we're from Australia, if anyone is new to the channel. Ooh, decisions. Yeah. Getting really close to Mrs. O there. <laughs> oh, it could be, if I get you, we're going to be pretty close. One, two, three, four, five, six, three. One, two, three, four, five. Ooh. I need to get a really good roll here. <laughs> Damn. <sighs> okay. All right. <laughs> One, two, three, four, five, six. So I'm almost lucky. Uh, so if I go past Lucky now, then I'm allowed to the, go The subsequent turn, you have yeah, to go back and forth. Forwards, yeah. Five. Which is good. I'm glad they haven't mm. made One, two, it so three, that four, if you go five. past Lucky, you have to go the whole way around oh, again. Oh, because I mean, it's, it's already a pretty basic game. That would be maddening. Um, it's not as basic as some. A lot of games based on like go, TV go shows. Go start just, to finish. Exactly. Um, this one, instead of start to finish, you have that little bit of strategy there with moving Mrs. O. So that's a plus. Hmm. Okay, so I'm obviously going to go past her because... Obviously. You know, I don't really have a choice. I go past Lucky, I mean. Yes. One, two, three, four, five. And now Mrs. O has to go for you, Nathan. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three. This is where I need a double. Okay. So I need a two on one of them. Oh. And I haven't got it. <laughs> one, two, three, four, five, six. But at least I can go backwards now. Oh, hang on. Six. One, two, three, four, five, six. You got one, a two. two. That's what I need. <laughs> I'm really trying to get you. All right, now I need a one. Oh, double four. Okay, that's unfortunate. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Oh, six. Uh, one, two, three, four, five. Probably not great to do that. One, okay, two. We... One, two, three, four, five, six. Uh, I'm not sure if we mentioned it doesn't matter whether you move elf first and then Mrs. O or vice versa. No. So you can do either one. So obviously you don't want to move her onto your pawn first. No. <laughs> All right. So one, two, three, four, five, six. Ooh. And I'm going to move one, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. One, two. Good on you, Kate. Keep it... elf safe. 
the only thing, I think the most frustrating thing about um, these games is just landing the on exact, exact space. Ground, yes. You could be miles ahead and be there first, but yes. you can still lose. <laughs> so, three? Like, I, that's and no six. good to me. One, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three. Oh, that's not good. Oh, three. One, two. Oh, we're both in the same section now. You need a one. I need a one. I need a one. <gasps> yeah. You got two ones. <laughs> there we go. I won. Hooray. <laughs> so that is the elf game. Um, it's it, it is simple, but like I said, not as simple as some of the games from TV shows. I just like it. it it's a neat little like collectible, especially if you like Elf the Show. Yeah. But I think so. if I was going to pick a board game to play at night, um, just just like for fun, <laughs> this probably wouldn't be it. No. Um, and and again, we we didn't watch the show. We're not fans of it. So I think I think maybe our opinion would be I more favourable had we been watching it. I think I've got a plush toy of him somewhere. Possibly out in That's the garage random. at the time somewhere. <laughs> if you enjoyed watching this video, give us a thumbs up. Let us know down below if you did watch this either uh, at the time it was originally on. Or if you've gotten into it re now. A, yeah, a rerun since then. Hit that subscribe button and check back next week. We have videos every Tuesday. Sounds good. Thanks for watching. Bye-bye.